Okay, here we go with 75% boards are better with bridge teacher Mark Nays. I've been under the opinion that declare play, um, I don't think I'm the genius as far as coming up with creative ways, like some <clears throat> experts, and I'm not an expert, so <laughs> both of those things I don't qualify, but I do think proper declare technique will really improve your game. And this one, <clears throat> I think, um, you know, makes that point clear um, on a, a few different things in this one. So I want you to kind of pay attention. It really does a little bit come down to a choice of why this one ended up being a 90% board. <clears throat> but this this one in this robot attorney was about 80 plays in it. Uh, 78 of the 80 people were in two spades. So the bidding was real similar. Uh, but there was only a few of us that, that made plus two. And I just, like I said, I... Um, I think it just comes down to proper technique and just ways to play things. And again, it's a little bit of 50-50, which you'll see at the end of why some were plus, some of us were plus two and some were plus one. But I'll I'll kind of just give you my thoughts and show it to you. So here we go. We end up in two spades. Again, clear bidding. I don't have anything to invite partner to find out if they're high end or low end of their of their bid. Um, so here we go. We get opening lead of nine of spades. I cover with the jack. I don't know where the king is yet, but I, if if it doesn't win, I want to. I decided I want to um, lead Trump again if it does win to kind of clear it out. So I, I cover with the ten. It does win, and then um, you know I look at okay. I want to lead diamonds from over there. I want to lead hearts from over here. So that's kind of okay. I do have a little bit of entries. Um, I don't see a reason. Um, so I do, I decide to lead the queen of clubs now. I thought I did Trump, but I guess I didn't. I do the queen of clubs now. Um, this will be part of what I call the technique part. I'm trying to clear out suits. So um, this is what happens here. I not only clear out the clubs, but now I set up a club for later. All right. So um, I'm going to do that right when I'm done um, pulling Trump. All right. So I'm done pulling Trump. Trump or 2-2, two, two, Jack of Clubs. And what card do you get rid of here? Okay. Um, what I have for losers left, um, I have a place for these two cards, right? I can trump them. So the only potential that can help me is the Four of Hearts. I see a lot of people get rid of a diamond here, but I've already got a plan for these, okay? So the Jack of Clubs, I'm going to put the heart on it. Now I've got a maximum of two losers in the heart suit as opposed to three, okay? Because now I've got four versus two, I can trump two hearts, right? All right, so now I'm in my hand. I've cleared out the club suit. Again, that's one of the techniques I want you to do. So if they lead clubs now, it's going to help me. I'll get a rough and a slough. It'll benefit me. They don't lead a club, but that's just one of the things I'll do generally right after pulling Trump. If there's a suit that I can clear out, Again, we always like looking to let them help us. So this combination, I have queen, 10. Between the two hands, I have ace, queen, 10, nine. I decide to lead the queen because I have the 10 and the nine. If I see the king, it's going to set up a trick. Um, and it loses to the king, All right? So now I don't really know this, but you can see that really no matter what Wes leads, okay, <laughs> they're going to have to help me in some way, all right? Again, um, they could lead a club, which then I could get rid of, you know, Trump and get rid of a heart loser, could go rough and a slough. They lead a heart, I can let it come into my jack. They decide to lead a diamond, and that helps as well because they're leading away from their jack. So clearing out the suit, if I didn't do the clubs until now, they'd have a safe lead in clubs, uh, but they do not. Okay, so I took care of that by clearing out the club. So now they lead a diamond and I am able to get a trick with the 10. I decided to overtake it uh, because I wanted to um, lead hearts from over here. Um, and so I do a diamond and get rid of a heart. Okay, now I lead the jack of hearts. I can afford to lead the jack because I only have two in the suit. I'm trying to encourage them to cover with the queen because I do have the 10. I still had a third heart here. You have to play a little, you have to lead up to the 10 and hope and whatever. And so this is another technique that I'll usually do. All right. They didn't cover. 
So I'd let it go. I call it a double finesse. We don't know where the ace or the queen are at this point in time. And so far, they've kind of been fairly even with the points they've shown up with. And so it, it wins in that they have to win it with the ace. Okay. So come back and we're all good to go. And I just claim at this point in time. So again, I could have, uh, if I go up with the king there, then I, I only make it. But I still thought this hand was worth putting this video together for you because it was showing a lot of things that I think um, will get you those higher boards. I mean, basically what you're looking for is you're looking to, you know, get that 55, 60% score. And then once in a while have that huge score and not have any of those zeros, you know, so your bad boards are like 40%. And I think proper declare play technique will get you there. All right. So there was quite a few things in this one um, that, we were able to do and it worked out to be an 89% board for in my opinion, nothing special. So um, go ahead and put these practices into place. Uh, if you're looking for lessons, um, I can I do individual lessons for one, two or three, one, two or four basically online. Um, and, um, and I have some group games and different things if you wanna do that stuff too. But anyway, thanks for uh, hanging out with me and uh, hopefully you learned something, you put these in, into practice and uh, smash that like button, subscribe, lets YouTube know these videos are worth me putting together and we'll see you next time. Enjoy the game. It's a great one, just love it. <laughs>